Hey everybody, East Coast Reefer here. Today I'm going to take you through the unboxing and, and acclimating of an order I placed with Prestige Reef. Uh, I've got their mystery box and uh, a couple of other corals you can see at the end there. I'll go through those at the end. Uh, just take you through what I've ordered. So the box came very well packaged. Uh, arrived next day after a few emails with uh, Ryan to arrange it all and they come in these great little pots so I tried to go through each one here to show you what they looked like straight out of shipping um, it was a little bit tricky because the pots themselves are a bit opaque um, so they're not the easiest to see through but I tried to give some kind of hint at what they looked like when they arrived and they all pretty much looked fine. I think the only one really was the uh, purple bee zoas that were kind of really elongated, stretched out looking for some light while they were in the packaging. But um, that's to be expected really, as you can see there. So here they are, just temperature acclimating in my tank. Uh, I just did this for half an hour or so just to get the temperature up. And then I took each pot emptied it out into a second pot with the water that was in it so it's the same water um, and then each one it took me a while to work out how to actually get them out there in the end uh, and each one I just kind of placed in this pot and then tipped the, other, the next pot's worth of water in um, and when I got to the end of that I actually added some of my tank water to make it up to one litre uh, just so that they were acclimating to the water chemistry as well and I did try and show each one on the camera but the first few it didn't do a very good job on the autofocus some of the latter few I stood in the way so I had the plain background of my t-shirt so I could focus a bit better with the acclimation in, in this pot I added some of my tank water as I said and then a cap full of the two little fishies revive dip mixed that all around agitated it with the turkey baster just to kind of flush through everywhere um, and left that in for eight minutes and then I have a second pot which I use just to rinse off any of the dip and then I'll stick all the coral right at the very bottom of the tank for the lowest light level and then slowly bring them up to acclimate them to the light demand as well and here you can see them all in the tank all lined up this was um, six hours or so after um, they were put in the tank maybe a little bit less so the coral in here from left to right are the kung pao the sun god leptoceris uh, tutti fruity zoas mad martian lepto some green Psyllopora, mean streak monty then purple bee zoas and german blue digi so thank you very much for watching to the end if you found this useful and interesting please like share subscribe hit the bell icon all those things that help me get more viewers um, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.